Welcome back to Man United fans and their tender Manchester United 1, Tottenham Hotspur 6. An absolute embarrassment. And you're right, I can't be asked to get annoyed. It's an absolute disgrace from what we just saw right there by a Manchester United performance. And look, it's just simply... I'm, I'm absolutely gutted and I can't be asked to get annoyed because look, we got annihilated. We got absolutely destroyed by Tottenham. So first, you know, in the first minute, you know, Martial made the brilliant one from kickoff and then it's a penalty for Manchester United. Bruno Fernandes goes on and scores it. And then, oh, and then Tottenham score two minutes later from a Harry Maguire mistake and just the, the whole, whole defensive mistake, it, which is just absolutely ridiculous. And then Song comes on and scores another Harry Maguire and defensive mistake. I'm, I'm saying Harry Maguire because this all was down to him. He's the captain. He's the most overrated defender uh, in a very long time. I have got to be completely honest. And then, and then that stupid incident where in, in, in the box where Tottenham have a corner uh, Lamella whacks his arm in Martial's face and then Martial just gives him, a, you know, just a little tap back. Uh, uh, you, you know, a little, just a little soft punch. Searching. And then Lamella goes down. The United players stand there in shock. Just like, how have you gone down from that? But oh, I can't believe it. And then, you know, the players just couldn't be asked from there. Martial got sent off it and that shouldn't have even been a bloody yellow card. It was a straight red and then, uh, and then Harry Kane came, uh, and then you know ha Harry Kane uh, came up with a goal, and then from there it was four one, and then we go into the second half, it's it's five one, then it's six one, and yeah, six one to Tottenham. It's it's just it's just an absolute disgrace to be honest with you. From a Manchester United perspective, no, literally no one played well. No one played well for Manchester United, and this is all down to the board. Look, we, we, we need to be bringing in signs. It's deadline day tomorrow. And, you know, we've heard stuff about Tellers. We've heard stuff about Cavani. And apparently, uh, and apparently, you know, they are quite close to happening. But still, just moving on to that performance, it's an absolute disgrace. I wonder what they are thinking, to be honest with you. Coming into Manchester United, having to deal with this rubbish. I mean, Luke Shaw has to get out as well. And I'm really glad that this Tellers that this Alex Tellers did was closing in because we really need a new left back. But the most important thing is that we need the centre back. We need the new centre back. Uh, I mean, it makes you think, is, Har is it Harry Maguire who's the problem or is it Victor Lindelof who's the problem uh, at, with our centre backs? I thought, because I think Bailey's better than Lindelof, but should we start Lindelof and Bailey? Because there was no problems with that during the weekend's Brighton, but, you know, we were playing Brighton. Um, and today we got annihilated by top. And, you know, look, look, we saw the team and, you, you know, we thought, you know, we were doing going to do half decent. I predicted us to actually keep a clean sheet and win this 2-0. It's an embarrassment from what we just saw from Manchester United. I thought every player was embarrassing, to be honest with you. Bruno got the goal, so, you know, fair play. But apart from that, you know, Ben, he, he didn't really do anything. Martial did nothing. Pogba had a few chances. Rashford, um, Maguire was dreadful. Shaw was dreadful. Yeah, and, 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 you know, Bruno didn't play great after it. Greenwood wasn't great. Um, I, I, I overall thought that, you know, every player was just dreadful. And, and, you know, we absolutely didn't deserve anything out of that game. We deserved nothing whatsoever. And, you know, we got... Oh, it's just it, Look, we got destroyed 6-1 by a team that wants to park the bus. And it, it's just ridiculous. We're a defensive side and we're getting thrashed 6 1 by another defensive side. It's just, it's an absolute joke from what we're seeing at Manchester United. Half these players need to actually be sold, uh, to be honest with you. They really do need to be sold. And Edward Ward, Glazers, they need to really buck up their ideas. I, I, and to be honest with you, I really can't be asked with them. I really cannot be asked with them whatsoever at Manchester United. And I don't think Ollie's going to get sad, but, you know, the, you, you, you can't really blame Ollie. Uh, I, I mean, overall, the, I, I mean, look, to be honest with you, yes, he did make a few bad decisions, but, you know, Ollie's wanted signings, and it would have really helped if we got some signings. Why aren't we actually starting Van der Beek? Why isn't he starting? We signed him on a £40, mi 40 pound million deal. £40 million pound deal. And he's not starting for Manchester United week in, week out. He's only starting the cup games. What's the point? And it's just a joke with us trying to finalise transfers, to be honest with you. Because we've needed that this summer. 
you know, Ollie knows and he's been really trying and, you know, Ollie just looks, he, he, he looks lost. He does not know what to do. He does not know what to say. His press conference and everything. He just really has... Uh, I really do feel sorry for him. But, you know, the play is a, a, an absolute disgrace. Because the thing is, the play is a dreadful. Harry Maguire, £80 million. Pound. I can't actually be asked. I really can't. But, yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching this video. The Man United fans out. Speak to you soon. Anyway, thanks for watching.